Hello and welcome to the tip of the week. So last week we talked about developing quant methods for powders. So this week let's talk about developing quant methods for liquids. I really like using an ATR for this work because you have a constant path length and it's really easy to use and clean up. So when you're developing a quant method you need to cover the whole range of your components of interest from the low end up into the high end and this will give you the best method so by covering that complete range you may find that you have a lot of samples to measure so in this case you might want to consider using automation like our auto ATR it makes collecting a whole bunch of samples within one run really simple so thanks for watching and we'll see you next time